Welcome to ITU Telecom World 2019 here in Budapest, Hungary. We're very pleased to be joined in the studio today by Dr. Matthias Poli, who is uh, the uh, Vice President for R&D Devices and Monitoring Network Testing for Rodin Schwartz. Welcome to the studio. Thank you. Now, I wanted to start off by talking about uh, this event's uh, theme. It is Innovating Together, Connectivity That Matters. Uh, what it, why is connectivity so important and, and what is meaningful connectivity in your, in your opinion? I think we heard during the open ceremony a uh, very important thing. Half of the people are connected to the internet, which is a great achievement. And uh, we personally en endeavor the internet and uh, have something in our life uh, as a merit out of it. But we shall not forget that half of the people are not connected. And uh, now focusing on meaningful connectivity means that, uh, from my perspective, that we uh, I think it has to be a combined effort of government and uh, business companies uh, to bring internet also to the remaining half of the people. And meaningful connectivity is that we just not shall provide 5G network there, but it has also to be a content which uh, is uh, good for the people, where they can afford the service and which is then locally localized the content, so that's really to the benefit of the people. I think here it requires smart technology, therefore also the business companies are, but it's also the government who has to set the right frameworks. What uh, single innovation in technology, policy or strategy do you think has got the greatest potential to drive digital transformation? If we talk about digital transformation, I would like to differentiate between digital transformation and digitization. Digitization has happened. Uh, if we talk, look for example, cloud computing is one keyword where people think, ah, oh, this is digital transformation. The processes and technologies inside cloud computing have been digitized before. It's just now that they're in the cloud. So digital transformation is about acting and thinking. It changes uh, totally workflows, work streams, value streams. It's, for example, more about loan services rather than investing goods. And uh, IT becomes an actor. It's like autonomous driving. And I think this is, for me, the key invention uh, where we come into artificial intelligence. And IT will be an actor in artificial intelligence. And this is the greatest invention which will drive digital transformation. And what's your, your role and role of uh, Roder and Schwartz in the digital economy? Of course, we will uh, use the digital economy. We will sell our goods via the internet. Um, but there's also, we have certain cloud services uh, already in place. But uh, Rudin Schwarz will also focus on making this possible because uh, if everything is digital, uh, we have to think about cybersecurity and make the, safe, the world safe and sound. And this is some key areas where Rudin Schwarz is working on. And what are the main challenges in, in, in cybersecurity and, and data protection that you found? The main challenges is the enormous, tremendous impact a disaster, a worst case scenario has on all of us. If everything is connected and something goes wrong, oh, holy shit. So we have to invest in cybersecurity. This is something which do not provide you the service as now, but it makes it safe and sound, and this is very important. And finally, let me ask you, you're, you're no stranger to ITU events. Uh, uh, you have been here a, a number of years, I know. Uh, Roda and Schwarz has been uh, supporting this event very, very strongly. I just wanted to ask you, what's the value of attending and, and participating in events such as this? Of course, we would like to exhibit or to show our products uh, which uh, are fit to the themes. But on the other hand, it's also about networking. I think digital transformation is one thing where's a new trend which changes our society and I think maybe there will be a next one it's good for this uh, kind of event to meet people and talk about because we as a company have to adapt to the future technology and that's its, it's exhibition and networking. Well uh, I wanted to thank you very much for joining us in the studio and uh, and for joining us here at ITU Telecom World and hopefully we'll, we'll catch up with you again soon Dr. Matthias Pauli thank you very much indeed. Thank you very much. Thank you.